Just this year in June, we'll be opening our 10-hole par-3 golf course called The Bats. Two acre putting green, so we'll have 18 or 27 holes set up on the on the putting green as like a putting course, and then a small patio and a cabin area to do entertainment as well. We've got music, we've got speakers around the entire putting green, um, we've got music piped into the patio as well. You know, we'll be serving spotted cows like crazy up there, so I think people are gonna come up to play, and they're gonna find themselves hanging out for two hours after they're they're done with their uh, the 10 hole part three, whether playing the putting course just hanging around the fire pit. You build fun into a short course by uh, making it flexible. Almost every one of the holes you could play from about 60 yards, and then the longest one you could play from about 175 yards. If you play the proper tee boxes, they're all gonna play between 80 and 170 yards. So you build fun into it by making it not terribly penal. Uh, there's a few holes. The second hole has some you know, deeper bunkers along the left-hand side, but the fourth hole is very forgiving. Fifth hole can be very forgiving. So you just make it a little bit more playable um, and then give those options for the appropriate tee boxes. I've been out there with my you know, nine and 11 year old son and my 11 year old son can hit it okay. So we tee him off at about 100 and then we move my nine year old up to about 60 yards, find a flat spot and you hit it from there. And we're gonna give people the opportunity to say, you know, what tee box do you wanna play? You guys can play it from wherever, wherever you want, whatever you wanna do. There's some recommended tee boxes out there, um, but you can do whatever you want. You know, that's really all about fun.